Hello everyone and welcome to Daily Football News. Please subscribe for more updates. Eric Ten Hag's desire to land a new striker in January has seen Manchester United make an inquiry for former Chelsea forward Timo Werner, according to a report in Germany. It is claimed that the former Chelsea flop is not satisfied with his current situation with RB Leipzig. Manchester United's attack has been of major concern this season, with Hojeland, Marcus Rashford, Anthony Marshall, Anthony Alejandro Garnacho, and Jadon Sancho still exiled from the first team after falling out with Ten Hag, are all struggling for a steady stream of goals. Manchester United's plan is to recruit a support striker for Hojeland in January amid concerns over their £72 million signings development. The Denmark striker is yet to open his Premier League account since arriving from Atalanta in the summer, though he has scored five times in Europe. The 20-year-old arrived at Old Trafford nursing a back injury which has hampered his start to life with United. However, there is also a sense at United that Hoyland would benefit from working alongside a more experienced centre-forward who would also be able to share the goal-scoring burden. Despite his struggles at Chelsea, it appears Werner has been identified as someone who could fit that bill. It would be fascinating to see if Werner would want a shot at redemption in England after such a miserable spell first time around. The German striker signed for Chelsea for £53 million back in 2020, but he never managed to settle into a rhythm. Werner managed just 23 goals from 89 matches, although he did collect a Champions League winner's medal in 2021. Chelsea chose to cut their losses and sell Werner back to RB Leipzig in the summer of 2022 for just £23.5 million, taking a significant hit on their initial outlay. Werner is capable of playing centrally and out wide and would provide that level of experience that Ten Hag is seeking. Do you think signing Timo Werner is a good idea? Let us know your opinion in the comments section below. Stay tuned to our channels throughout the day for more updates. We will always give you good football reports here. Please don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe to my YouTube channel for more Manchester United news and updates. Thanks for watching.